Now, when everything is installed, be it on OpenBox, be it on i3, and everything is working, you see your um, volley bar. Then, then the fun starts. So, let's go ahead and um, check out. There's a wallpaper change. Let's quickly have a look. Oops, it's nice. Skeletus musculus, right? So, anyway, a bit distracted here. What can we do when everything works? We have this polybar, be it an open box on i3. You scroll down, scroll down, scroll down, scroll down, till here. When you see modules A to Z, from here on the font starts. The elements that you see up here can be defined. You can choose whatever elements you want to see in the polybar. And what elements are they? They are called AUR updates, they are called backlight, ACPI, and so on. So let's give it, let's start with the first one, AUR updates. Control C, remember where you are. If you're an open box, you need to go a little bit further down. This is I3, and you need to look for these elements, modules left, center, and right. And you'll usually put them in the center to experiment, save, and then you see here that the cower is not installed command not found our first problem control uh enter control return yeah let's activate the screen key so again super return gives us a term we do not have cow hacker cow it's not standard installed and there's a reason for it let me show the reason when you install it with zero it's a yes no. Then we get an error. One or more PGP signatures couldn't be verified. Okay. The next stop is probably going to be the kit that you try. And you say, let's try this one then. Maybe this will work. And then we try that one. And it works. All right. So this cover up here, just put your cursor somewhere in the config file of polybar and save and everything will be reloaded and there you, are. you have it the cower is now installed it's a cower kit version i was going to explain how to install the other one the cower version and that's actually by asking help packer has things you can add like this one skip integrity check when using make package do not check nd5 but it will also work with these signatures that you're uh, getting here, this error that we got here. One or more PGP signatures could not be verified. So that will work as well. Adding skip in tech to the packer. Well, anyway, it worked. It installed and it checks in the AOR of the packages coming from the AOR. Do I need to update? That's all it does. That's the module um, that we have here. And um, that's enough for this tutorial.